All right. Good morning, everyone. This is this is going. This is today's. Um, today we're going to be. We're going. To, I'm going to read. I'm going to read to you this. This devotion, on a uh, devotional plan on you version. It's called the uh, struggle and triumph. What God says I have. We're going to look at day three. We're going to do day three. And. Uh, I have hope is the title of today's book today today's devotion yes my soul find rest in God my hope comes from him Psalm 62 5 an athlete cannot run with money in his pocket pockets he must run with hope in his heart and dreams in his head Email, email, and that, that I don't know how to say the name. Was he was a, he was an Olympic gold medalist from Czech, 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 Czechoslovakia in the 1952 Summer Olympic Summer Olympics in Hel Helsinki. Helsinki. He won three gold medals in the. 5,000 meters, 10,000 meters, and, and the marathon. The most incredible aspect of his accomplishments was that he decided at the last minute to compete in the first marathon of his life. He must have been running with a, with running with a hope, that hope and the dreams of spoke and the dreams he spoke of. Sadly, the hopes and dreams that, that an athlete must have to accomplish great feats can only be can be shattered one bad race or competition or from a bad injury the bible confirms that the devastation of shattered hopes say repeat that the bible confirms the, the, the devastation of shattered hopes in proverbs 13:12 where it states hope deferred makes the heart sick but a long but a longing fulfilled but a longing fulfilled is a tree of life it is Christians. We are. We have a hope that cannot be, can't be shattered, or taken away from from us, under any, by any circumstances. <clears throat> For our hope is in Christ Jesus. He assures us that we have everything we need in Him. While we while we are here on earth, we have life with Him. After He light leave, after we leave this world, He is the way, the truth, and the life. He provides hope and peace and love for here and the for here and the world beyond. This hope we have is assured by death, by the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ, proving He is God and able to accomplish all He promises us. And we find these promises recorded in the Bible, the Word of God, Romans 15 verse 4. For everything that was written in the past was written to teach us, so that that through the endurance Taught in, taught in the scriptures and the encouragement they provide, we might have hope. No matter if we accomplish all our hopes and dreams as athletes or not, in this, in not a single one, or not a single one, we we have hope in Christ for this life and beyond that we can never lose. The application: Take a few minutes to think about the hope you have in, have in Christ and thank Him for it throughout the day. Let all that let all that I am quietly I'm sorry. Let that let all that I am wait quietly before God. My for my hope is in him. Hope deferred makes the heart sick, but a dream fulfilled is a tree of life. Such things were written in the scriptures long ago to teach us, and the scriptures gave us hope and encouragement as we wait patiently for God's promises to be fulfilled. And that's and that's uh and that's that's today's and that, that is today's, today's devotion. Thanks for watching. God bless you. I hope to, I hope to you. God bless. You.